Hello, James from Year 11 Plus Tutors in Essex again. Um, today I'm coming back to last year's CSSE paper where they had um, a challenge question for collecting right terms. Um, so what we need to do is look at the problem. So all of these sides equals 120. Um, we need to simplify what it's saying here so we can see so we get a clearer picture of what's going on so we can easily solve the problem. So the first thing I would do is collect the x's together. So we've got 10x, and we've got minus 5x. So always go by the symbol before the number. So you've got minus 5x plus 4x. That equals 9x. The next thing we need to, do, need to do is collect the numbers. So numbers on their own are treated separately in algebra. So uh, you go by the symbol before this, so it's positive 77. The operator before it, minus two equals 75. Okay, so what we've actually got here, when we simplify this, using collecting right terms, is nine x, plus 75 equals 120. So to get 9x, we need to take this over here, do the inverse, equals 45. Then what we need to do is, now we know that 9x is 45, we know that 45 divided by 9 must be x, so x equals 5. So could you pass the CSSC paper last year without being able to do part B? Probably, but they like to put in what I call you know, the stretch questions, the challenge questions, just to get that differentiation between the marks of the high flyers. You know, it's a neck and neck race sometimes, so every mark counts. Yes, you could pass this with just being able to do part A of the question. It's a lot more achievable. But I think being able to understand this to its fullest will make your child even more competitive in the exam. Um, I hope you've enjoyed that. Please feel free to rewind this and replay bits of it. Um, I hope that helps. Please remember to subscribe, hit the thumbs up. See you next time. Thank you. Goodbye.